Over the past few months, an increasing number of people have been asking me about information on getting grounded to work. Currently, it doesn't work on the Steam Deck out of the box. However, I have some fixes to get you fully working. The first issue is that after you go to launch, it will get stuck on the loading screen and you won't be able to do anything. First step is to get that fixed, so head into desktop mode. In your Steam client, right click on grounded. Go to the properties, to the local files so that we can open it in the file manager. From here, go into the folder named main, then into binaries and win64. Inside here, you can rename or simply remove the file named speech synth wrapper.dll. Doing just that will allow you to get into the game right to the main menu where you can dive in and play some single player. The extra problem here though is that as you can see the Xbox login screen for online play is completely blank. While that's not required if you want to play single player, it's obviously a problem if you want to play with your friends. Well, I've got an easy fix for that as well. I went over all of the older official Proton versions, it was broken in all of them, but then along comes the friendly neighbourhood GE Proton to save the day. Even here though, you need an older version of that. To get it, in desktop mode, you need the ProtonUp-Qt application from the Discover software store. Once loaded, hit Add Version at the bottom, make sure it's set to GE Proton, and then scroll down in the version list to find the very latest in the 6 series, so 6.21-2, and set that to download. Once you have it downloaded and installed, go back into gaming mode, and then we can set this as the forced compatibility layer in the properties. Then we can load into the game, and you can watch as the Xbox login screen now displays correctly, and the login does go through. Two points here though, you might need to use the mouse or touch screen to focus on the input box directly, and you will need to bring up the Steam keyboard manually with Steam Plus X. Once you've done the login, quit the game and uncheck the forced compatibility box to revert it to the official stable Proton because that has all the latest fixes and performance improvements. Just to make a point on how this is actually fully fixed with that, I will now be loading into a multiplayer game that I'm going to host I will pick a character and then actually go into the game and you will see that it works. Out of the box though, the performance is not great. I'm not doing any kind of performance special stuff here. This is just a guide to get you working and get you into the game. You can mess about with all the graphics settings after you've actually fixed it. So I hope this helps and do let me know what you think about this in the comments. I'm hoping all of this can be fixed in a future version of the official Proton. Thanks for watching and for following along and I'll see you later. TV shows. <laughs> All right, be cool, Max. You're gonna be famous. Nah, nah, nah. This isn't looking good, Max. It's a speedy little green corn pup. Whoa, look at the size of that ant. Honestly, I'm just glad it's not big enough to squish me. What was that? Some sort of radio signal? I wonder where it's coming from. <laughs> 